Cattle futures were under pressure to start the new month and quarter, but found their footing in today's trade. At the close, June live cattle futures at $1.05 higher to settle at $176.37. May feeder cattle, that was $2.17 higher to settle at $2.44.85. And on the snout side, the most actively traded month, June, settled $0.22 cents higher to $103.72. The recent rise in volatility can be visualized by the CME Group Seavol Live Cattle Index, which reached its highest level since the middle of December, reaching as high as $19.17 today. To put that in perspective, it was just 12.35 two weeks ago. Now, during the sell-off late last year, it did reach as high as 22.31. Now, volatility is a key component to option pricing. So, if you're not act, if you are active in the market, it will be something you want to keep a very close eye on. And you can go to cvol.com to visualize that for any commodity future out there that's listed on the CME exchange. Now, much of the pressure to start the week, that is the big ticket item. That came on the back of ongoing concerns regarding the potential spread of H5N1 bird flu as reports of human infection in Texas were confirmed. Now, on the cash side of things, the five area average price was able to hold ground coming in at 188.23 yesterday. Cutout values, they were weaker. Choice cuts 98 cents lower to 305.74. And select cuts down $1.64 to 301.79. Daily slaughter was reported at 109,000 head. That was 9,000 below last week and about 11,000 head less than the same day last year.